Well, what is going on, Cosmic Army? PTS42 here, and welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm. In the previous episode, we decided to play hooky with Rachel Amber. We went on quite a magnificent adventure. If you missed the last episode, there will be a link down in the description and up in the card section as well. So go through there, watch that, and get caught up, because I think this time around, this is going to be the last episode for episode one, Awake. So... Yeah, in any case, Chloe's super mad, and um, I guess what we need to do is break a bunch of stuff. We picked up this baseball bat, and all of the options are Smash. Now, do we, do we want to go with Smash number one, two, three, or four? I'll just go with this one, because I think they're all going to do the same thing. That's how blinded Chloe is by all of this rage right now, just to smash everything. That's, that's how upset she is, and it's really sad to see, you know? It's super sad to see. All right, well, let's bust down this the sign here. Smack it down. God, she she is relentless right now. I would not if I saw this happening, I would probably walk away or let it happen because I'd be scared that, you know, she would probably smash my face in just like she's about to do to this you know, mannequin, right? You, you can't take your eyes off her. Oh, that's sad. She's talking about Rachel. Description. Oh, Forgot right. Rachel. Yep. Right, take the hat off. Good job. I knew that was gonna happen. You can just tell how angry she is. All right, break the box of junk. Ooh, there's a camera in there. You gonna smash the camera then? I've never understood your hard on for cameras, Max. Yeah. You took a million pictures of us, and not one of them showed that you were gonna leave when oh, I Oh, God, my heart. We are starting things Fuck off cameras. really freaking, really freaking emotional this time. And she feels so portrayed by Max, and we know that all too well. We all- we know. We know that. And there's a toolbox. You're gonna you have something to say about David. Apart from the inside, it's important to bring the proper tools. Oh. Chloe, I'm so sorry. Fuck you, David. Nice throw, though. Dang, you got- you got some nice muscles. Oh god. Chloe! You need to relax, bro. What are you gonna do this truck? Ooh, man, this isn't good. All right, uh, we keep keep the rampage going, or what? What's the plan, Chloe? What? What did you just look at? Is Rachel there? Did was Rachel watching this entire time? Maybe. Dad. Dad. No way! Are you kidding me? That's Chloe's dad's car! Oh! Oh, my heart! It's breaking for Chloe! Oh my god, this is so sad! Oh no, Chloe! Everything's gonna be alright! Oh, this is so sad! So emotional! Jeez Louise! Chloe, you can get through this. We know you can. We know you can. Oh god, that that's gotta be it's so heartbreaking, even for me, but just imagine what's going through Chloe's mind, right? Like insanity, man. I can't even imagine. Oh, and there's still is that his her dad's blood down there on the bottom of the car just dried up? Oh my god, this is so sad. Chloe, she hasn't even said anything yet. Oh. Smash. It's my only option. I guess I kind of have to, don't I? Oh. Sorry, Chloe. I'm so sorry. We have to smash again? All right, Chloe, do your thing. Don't hurt yourself. That thing's been there for quite some time, you know, but I'm sure at this point you're not you're not too worried about tetanus. She's just so upset, and it breaks my heart to see her like this. Oh. Chloe! No. So sad. Oh. All of these emotions just come back, you know? <laughs> oh, God. It's too emotional. I can't handle this. My heart, it's breaking for Chloe. Oh. 
Chloe. God, I'm so upset right now. Are we? Oh no, we're back in the car. Yeah, we know this. We've seen this before already, haven't we? Yeah, that's our dad. Why are you crying, sweetheart? Oh. Whoa, why is there... Why was there a crow there? Come on, let us have this happy because moment. You're not real. Even if it isn't real. <laughs> I'm not. No. What is going on? Yeah, this is weird. What is going on? Oh. The mannequin. We smashed the head off I the guess mannequin. I did that. Yeah, what? Well, I think we did do that. Kiddo, look on the bright side, would ya? What bright side? What bright side? Yeah, take the words right out of my you mouth. Made a new friend today. Yeah, but she kind of left us. Is that right? That is Rachel. Are we hallucinating? Are we dreaming? Or what is going on? Chloe, are you going to be okay? That's my main concern. There's the wine bottle that we I stole. I feel drunk. Pretty sure we stole that. That's the one we stole from the couple Gotta at say, the park. That was some fight. A yeah. lover's quarrel, you might say? Maybe. <laughs> I don't she know. She nearly took your head off. Hmm. I guess it... Yeah. I think we were pushing Rachel a little too far. We're passing the tree again. And we're passing Rachel again. What do you care? Interesting. Sorry, sweetheart. I guess I'm getting into your personal business. Yeah. I guess so. Not really anything else we can look at other than our dad. Or, honestly, just the poster is the only other thing we can look at. <sighs> I mean, even if this scene isn't like real and that's all in Chloe's head it's so beautiful and she gets to talk to her dad again and he's giving us and he's giving Chloe his input on everything that she's been through What's thus far prologue and yeah sometimes people need you though yeah sometimes they do and I'm guessing Rachel needs us is that Rachel it is. Whoa, that's freaky. Even when they don't admit it. That was freaky. Rachel. Oh god, my heart. Whoa, why are you on fire? Rachel. So I guess she really needs us. Maybe even more than we need her, but you know, I think oh no. Rachel. Oh no! Oh, Chloe's waking up. I guess we fell asleep in our dad's car. Which I guess that makes sense as to, you know, I guess why we had that dream about what just happened with our dad and with Rachel. And he got to talk to us and he told us that Rachel needs us, you know? And I think he knows, even though if it's a dream, but he's reaching out to us. You know, he's reaching out to Chloe, you know. Just to let her know that he's okay. And she needs to be okay for his sake. And for her sake. Ugh. Oh, Chloe, Chloe. Chloe, Chloe! What are you gonna do, man? What are you gonna do? I'm really curious to find out. But I guess we need to find Rachel. You know? That's, I guess, what we need to do. At least that's what I think we should do. Oh, man. She's been... Chloe's been through the ringer. Max left her all alone. Clo or, yeah. Max left her all alone, and then Rachel kind of just ditched us, even though she doesn't want to admit it to herself that she needs us. But we need her just as much. And there's a crow. We saw that in the flashback and the dream. So we're going to follow it. Seems like it. I wonder where it's going to lead us. All right, so it does look like uh, Chloe and I did follow this crow or raven. I'm not really too sure which one it is, but I guess it kind of it did lead us to Rachel. There's Rachel right there staring at the tree. And we saw her doing that in our dream with our dad. It is interesting, but I guess we kind of knew where to find her all along, I guess. Oh, she's crying too. You came. Of course I did. I'm glad. Yay, I'm glad you're glad. Me too. Hey. I couldn't let the day end with whatever this afternoon was. Very true. Not a good way Chloe, to end a day like today. I want to talk to you about something, but... Yeah? 
I don't know how to talk about this. That's okay. You don't have to tell me anything you don't want to. Yeah, seriously. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? Oh, it's that tree. The ones who were making out? Yeah, I remember that guy. That's when everything turned with Rachel. Dad. No oh. way. All right. And that woman was definitely not my mom. No oh. way. The worst part is... <laughs> That's sad. I'm not surprised. Oh, poor Rachel. I felt like my dad's been lying about something for a while. Yeah? I, just, I didn't know what it was. And I guess now you do, and so I guess now I we know. When I saw a text from an unknown number asking him to meet, I thought I, thought oh, I could catch him so or that's, something. Oh, so that's why we ditched school. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Rachel. I don't... I'm not gonna not say nothing. I don't know what to That's say. a bad option. It shouldn't I. even be there. Chloe, I love my dad. Yeah? I love him. And I never want to yeah. see his fucking face again. I'm sure you feel all sorts of betrayed, don't you? But when, then again, Chloe feels like died, that a lot too. From Max. I was so mad at him. For months, I felt wrong. Because... Half the time I thought of him, I wanted to scream. <sighs> and the other half, I forgot. She forgot. forgot that anything had changed. I don't know what to say during this. I just kind of want to watch and let it play it's out. Silly, but Ugh. I've carried this photo around with me for years. Oh, this is the one that was in her backpack. We Mount saw Hood. this. We saw My this dad picture. Took me hiking there when I was ten, and it started raining. And I fell yeah, and we looked at that when we gave her her belt. I remember screaming like I was going to die, but my dad, he carried me down the mountain. Aww. I still remember the smell of his coat and how calm he was and the sound of his voice. And Oh, Rachel, I'm so sorry. Let's comfort her. Comfort her. I think... Oh, no. You... No. It's just so strong. I guess you know, that was I, the wrong choice. I felt safe. But I just want her to know that I'm there. You know, I'm there for her. So I guess we could say you trusted him or no one's safe. But the thing is, we want her to trust us. And if we, if we say you trusted him, that could kind of show, like, maybe you shouldn't trust people kind of thing, you know? So let's say no one's safe. No one's ever safe. I think that's a better option yeah. to say. Here. Chloe, I owe you an apology. <clears throat> I owe you one too. Hey, we were both kind of the queen of shitty. I think we both no, were in our own terms. I mean it. Whatever's going on between us, it's intense and new and awesome. And I describe it like that as well. The courage to tell me that you feel it too. Aww. So and she feels the same shit. way. It's okay, Rachel. Courage. I don't know if I'd call it that. <laughs> or like, blind desperation. Oh, Chloe's coming and back out. The Chloe we know and love. And maybe a I slight buzz from know. the wine. Hmm. I'm lucky that you were with me today. Oh. Uh, oh. You're mm. a badass, Chloe Price. Oh, what? why, thank you. Remember that biker asshole who wouldn't let you into the mill? Yeah. You talked your way right past him. Of course I did. I remember that. You saw that? And, and she, what? She saw that? Who followed you upstairs? That's a good point. When did Two she see us? One. But you wouldn't take any shit from that. Of course I don't. I'd I'm Chloe Price, baby. That Better watch you out. Inspired me. Aww. Aww. And what about Drew? the way they look at each other? Oh my when heart. He was picking on Nathan. You got right in his face and called him. Yeah, out. we did. Yeah, we that did. That was pretty sweet, actually. <laughs> oh, Chloe. See? Oh, Rachel. You the My heart. Thing, Chloe. I don't know anyone like you. Plus, oh, you came my... along with me, no questions <laughs> asked. <laughs> well, what do I say? I don't really need a good reason to ditch school. Where's my professional YouTube commentary when you need it? Hell to pay. Uh, my mom might maybe. skip grounding and just go straight to the death penalty. Maybe. And my dad... 
will definitely punish me with... With what? Dude, F him, bro. Fuck your dad. Dude, F him. F Fuck him. Fuck him. Yeah. What I wouldn't give to leave mm. this place and never look back. Yeah, What's I think stopping us? exactly. I think they're Guys, both thinking the same thing. They're they're stopping. <laughs> yeah, they're stopping There's each other. There's nothing keeping me here, not anymore. So if I came to you tomorrow and told you to pack your bags, I'm serious. Let's do it, Chloe. Seriously? Let's leave this place forever. Okay. No way. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna leave Arcadia Bay. Oh. With Rachel. Oh. Don't. You're gonna drop it? Don't drop it. You gotta still keep memories, though. Can I borrow your lighter? Are you kidding? No, I wouldn't do that. I mean, I get the situation, but still. Hmm. That's sad, too. I don't know. I, I have a whole new influx of freaking emotions going through my head, going through my mind, going through my heart. Oh, wow. And there goes the picture. There's Rachel. Sobbing still. She's still crying. And she's letting go of the past. And the future, kind of. I don't know. She's not necessarily forgiving her dad, but just kind of getting rid of him in a sense you know come on oh oh that's bad Rachel oh my god jeez dude that was a scream if I've ever heard one jeez Louise Set the tree on fire. This is intense. And I'm... Jeez, I got chills. Why am I getting chills? I don't know. Jeez Louise. This is, this is too much. This is too much, dude. But the fire is seriously a bad thing. I mean, it's beautiful, but... You should probably get the hell out of there, guys. Seriously. Oh, man. I wonder what Chloe's thinking. Wow. Now that is beautiful. But, you know, really dangerous. Really bad for the environment, too, obviously. Okay, here we go. There's the raven or the crow. And it kind of. Oh, they're back at the mill now. There's Frank. Is this like a preview that's what to come in the next episode? I think we're definitely at the end. Oh, th no, this is still happening. Okay, that is incredibly beautiful. Scary at the same time. And there's, uh, there's our mom and David. Interesting, interesting things going on. I guess everybody can see this fire. Wow, that is huge. Chloe and Rachel started that, so that's not that good. There's Nathan. Man. Oh, and there's Mikey and Steph and then Mikey's older brother Drew, I believe. But now, not everybody seems so bad, you know? Everyone's just sharing this experience. Okay, there's the principal. Principal Wells, I believe is his name. And I think that's Rachel's dad as well next to him. I think. Must be. Yeah. And who is that? Is that... Is that the girl that his dad was with? Or Rachel's dad was with? It might be. It seems like it. Wearing the same clothes. Very interesting. And that's it. Life is strange before the storm. So that was episode one, Awake. Wow. All right then, guys. So it looks like that is the end of episode one, Awake. And we can take a look and see, uh, you know, how we, how we, you know, our choices, the choices we chose to choose upon, you know, nice word choice. Thank you very much. But in any case, let's take a look. So the first big choice we made, we ran away and that was only 37% compared to 63%. Okay. Let's see. You were mean to Joyce, 38%. So not, not on the major majority yet. You defended Nathan, 87%. And you told Rachel that you are more than just friends, 74%. Let's take a look at the next page. Oh, there's, oh my god, there's a bunch of different choices of, and different things that we did. But I'm not going to go through the rest of this. 
Oh, okay, so I guess this is the preview for the next episode. All right, no we got to check this out. Steals from me. I want my fucking money. Whoa, what is happening in episode two? Oh, Brave New World. Next episode coming soon. Okay, play collector mode and complete your graffiti collection. I do want to do that. I don't know if I'm going to make a video of me getting all of the tags and all of that stuff, but I do want to go back and do that. If you want to see that, let me know by leaving a comment down below letting me know you, you want to see this challenge mode and get all those tags. But in any case, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this one here. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and want to see more Life is Strange Before the Storm, be sure to leave a like down below. And hey, if you're new to the channel, why not subscribe? You can get more awesome content just like this. And do not forget to ring that bell to be notified when I upload a video. But that said, you guys, that's going to be it for me today. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, Cosmic Army, I will see you in the next video. So until then, keep on being stellar.